Hello, I'm going to show you how to flash your EMMC using the Android. Uh, the first step that you have to do is to copy your SD card, uh, the Android version, and I will send you the link, the Android version, sorry. Uh, um, in the same device, you flash it to the EMMC. Uh, I will send you the link where there are more uh, steps to do this. So this will be like the continuation because on that video they show you how to flash the Android from the SD card to the MNC, but they didn't continue to show you how to flash the Ubuntu to the MNC after this step. So what I'm doing is that. So I have here a hard, a hard disk or drive that inside it has the Ubuntu, uh, the compressed file, and I also uncompressed it before. Uh, so I have the image there. Uh, here I have my my Android, and right now in this SD card, oops, sorry, <laughs> I have the Ubuntu uh, 14, which I'm using to flash it to the MMC that is already located and that has inside the Android, the Android, sorry, the Android. Um, so, uh, why do you need the Android? Because with the Android, you are able to read where your device is here. And uh, so you have to know where are your devices. And you have to work uh, to run the line sudo dd from, the, from where your image, your Ubuntu image is located. So let's do that. Let's open the terminal where my Ubuntu image is located. Uh, if you need to find where your um, where your device is, you have to go to. I don't know if you can see on the screen. You have to go to this address, dev this by ID, to find where your EMMC is located. You can go to properties, and in my case, is the MMC B L K zero. So we are going to take this address too. So. According to the instructions that you will find on the, on the web page uh, of Android, you have to write sudo. Uh, let's try to move this here. Sorry for the movement of the movie. I'm not easy to do both of them at the same time, but I think this is going to be useful for many because I've been struggling to do this for several days. Um, because I needed the Ubuntu, old, the old version of the Ubuntu on my MNC. So you need the input. The input file will be the name of your the, the name of your Ubuntu image. So let's go to copy it. It's, yeah, I've been trying to do this many times. And I will copy the Ampress version. It's this one. I just need we just need the name of the file. So this is the input file. Then we need the output file that I show you where the location is. Mm. Output file equal to the in this case, since we already know the address, oh, I can copy from here to uh, copy. Paste, and then you have to run. Let's see how it goes. Hope this will work. I hope this will work. Uh, I've been trying to do this so many times. Yeah, the problem that you maybe we have is that your SD card doesn't have enough space. So I recommend you to do this from your Mac if you have one uh, to copy the files, the image files, and then compress it in your hard drive. You know, then maybe you will have problems to to do it. Com equal f. Uh, let's 
así. That's for my sudo. My camera is not the best, but I just wanted to share this with you so you can do it <clears throat> easily instead of looking for several links. I'm also going to copy all the links that I, that I get, and I hope this really will work. Uh, I've been trying to do this with SD cards. I also broke an SD card. Uh, so the people from, from Mary Roy is very nice, but you go to the forums and there's so much information that hard to know which one to follow I think there should be one easy that says steps to copy to flash to the MMCC so well uh, that's what I'm trying to do actually you will need to see a previous video uh, that I can show you this right now meanwhile this is working I hope it's working so there is this video that is in the Ameridroid webpage. That is how to prepare the MMC from another Android for using that on the XU3, XU4, the one that I'm using in the XU4. And uh, what I will do is uh, save the, in the, on the SD drive, uh, download this, this link, let me check, sorry, yeah. They don't know this link from the from the forum EMC recovery tool that this are Android. So they copy the Android on the SD card uh, and they place the MMC, but all this with a switch on the on the SD card position. And then they turn off the device uh, let it the flashlighting in blue for um, it, it takes a while. Um, so you have to wait until the, the, the light is off. And then you will have uh, the Android flash on the EMC and you can run it actually. You can boot it and it will work. I've done it many times and it, wor it works fine. But you cannot do this for the Ubuntu image. Uh, so you have to do for the uh, next steps. And as I told you, you needed to have it on the... You need to have the Android on the EMC so your system will be able to to open it and recognize it. So I think there it could be another option that should be to use the OGFP adapter. So I have this adapter, this one, but every time that I try to do it by, with this PC, this uh, uh, with Windows, it said that actually I just tried to format it. I said it, it was protected. Uh, I also tried to do it with a Mac and it's also, also said that it was protected. So I wasn't able to use the adapter directly at least the micro SD adapter. And the people from uh, Mary Roy said that I have to buy a USB adapter that matches with a micro SD adapter. So yeah, well, I mean, I placed the order, but sometimes you cannot wait. And actually I cannot wait these days. I'm working on a project that I needed already urgently, but hopefully this will work and you will be able to see that in this video. And sorry if you get dizzy about my how I'm recording this video, but uh, yeah, I just wanted to show you. So let's wait. Let's wait. So what I'm doing now is flashing using the Ubuntu on the on the SD card. So uh, so I place uh, an SD card with the Ubuntu on it. I boot it and I look for the devices that I had. It was able to recognize the the AMMC with the Android inside, and I use an external hard disk drive. Oh, okay, so there it is. So it said that it's already uh, copied the five gigabytes, which is good as the, the, the size of the, of the file. So problems that I had to be able to do this is that uh, if you will try to duplicate it in a SD card, it may show that it's no f there is no full capacity. There, you don't have a space on your SD card. So I did on the hard on the, this hard uh, this uh, drive and it work, but using a Mac. So I would recommend you to do that. So I'll try it and let's see. Crossing fingers, it will work. <laughs> 